Welcome back. Let's play some 10 minute games here on Shogi Wars. I keep stating that maybe I should play Central File Rook. Well, maybe today's the day that we actually play that opening. Unless I feel in the mood to try something else, but I don't think I'm in the mood. It is kind of curious how far I've gotten playing Third File Rook. But that's not going to help me here. Not when I'm on the verge of promotion. Good luck. Okay. So. Um, yeah, we'll play this move order, I suppose. I'm so puzzled as to what's going on here. Our two Don opponent has played well to keep me confused. Um, okay. And consequently, I cannot easily push pawn 5-5 five five here. Um, hmm. Alright, we're not building Anaguma with just one gold. That would be crazy. So, our opponent shows bishop exchange as their predominant strategy. Somehow I don't feel like playing something that plays into that. So where I would normally offer a bishop exchange in very similar positions, here I don't quite feel like offering it. I want to try something else. I don't much care what, but something else. Um, now the bishop exchange is not something that's like um, non-negotiable. So here, I, at some cost, I will acquiesce to it. But there's going to be some cost for it. Okay, what's this? What is this? I've just slightly weakened this diagonal, but... Jumping the knight is spooky. I'm not actually going to jump it out. Um, not unless this sort of thing happens. I'm so perplexed. I can't retreat my silver here. Not without dropping this back first. So this is such a weak looking move, but um, I don't... Okay, I missed the tactical flaw with it. Now I see the tactical flaw with it. Good to know. Um, I was looking, I just didn't spot it. Uh. Hmm. Oh, that's risky. Um. All right. This kind of sucks. <laughs> Wait, what? How is this reasonable? I think I've missed something here. Oh dear. There are tactics everywhere here. Okay. Well, we'll try to make do in this position. Um, yeah, this is awkward. Hmm. Um, 
So I'm down almost two minutes with a much inferior position. I and no plan to boot. Yeah, this is not great. Um. We have seen better. Okay, the best I can think of is to drop this to safety. But, um, this is awfully precarious. Well, there's basically only one thing I can do here, so let's do it. I don't know how this is going to work, but it has to work. Hmm, tactics don't work out here. Not even close. That's most unfortunate. I need some plan B now. Hmm. Since plan A is such a hot mess... I need to find a different road. Um. Go hmm. Does that simply win? Somehow I thought that they had an easy plan here, but I'm not seeing uh, an immediate continuation. I guess they can now drop a bishop here. Um, yeah, it looks pretty decisive. If they drop the bishop, maybe it's best that... No, if my rook moves, I've got too much loose. Oh my gosh. Everything is hanging here. Simultaneously. Um... I don't understand. What is this? Why did they bother moving this knight out? There's some purpose to it, I just don't see it. Um...
so I'm looking, I'm looking, I'm still down over two minutes, but I'm not seeing the opponent's threat here. Um, oh, that, that's cool. Um, So if I take this, I win a pawn. Uh, rather, if I'd done this, they drop a pawn behind, and I've given them a turn for free. So I have a choice between material or time. Um, and at least that time, I selected time instead of material. Apologies for background noise. I can't control it. Um... I'll do the best I can, but I don't have control over it. Um, so I could drop a knight. Wait, no. Alright, let's see what tactics result here. Alright, so by throwing in pieces... Um... We produced this position. Oh crap. It's not that different, is it? I thought this would be meaningfully different. Um It seems my opponent might be tilting. Maybe I'm assessing this incorrectly. And if they take that, now they still don't have a fork. Incredibly. What to do? Oh! I have a fork. If you see a fork in the road, take it. I almost feel bad for these moves, for having played it on an unsuspecting opponent. Um, because they've played well much of this game. Nifun. Decisions are hard. Okay, we protect the square for a night drop. In the event that it comes to that. I think they have to take this. Uh, sure. Uh... 
I just hung a piece. Will they spot it? They spot it. Um, that's no good either. Boom. <sighs> oh, what a mess. Thanks for the game. One down, two to go. I apologize if I forget to... Good luck. If I forget to wish any opponent good luck. I certainly intend to, I just may have forgotten. I apologize if I did forget. Thought I had something here. Do I not?
I had this check, this would have been so much easier. It's fine though. Um. Let's aim at the king and hope that, well, don't want to take this, actually. No. I'll just aim at the king. Somehow things might work out. Oh, I had this drop, and I could take a gold. It's not a great profit by any means, um, but that could have been tried. If I dropped a lance, they could just drop a pawn. So, maybe that would not have mattered. Um, interesting. Is there a trick here? Nanafun. Like, on the surface, it looks like everything's covered. But I do wonder if some tactic could decide this game. Um. I think I just have to do the obvious thing here and push straight down the center. I don't think I have anything subtle that works better than that.
Interesting. I'm surprised I don't have anything obvious here. Wait, if I take this and then promote... Gofun. That, that doesn't work either. Alright, this is my best opportunity. I'm not sure if I believe in it, but um, I'm not seeing anything better than this. They can drop something on the back rank to make this... to fluster this attack. Yeah, uh, it wouldn't surprise me. I tried. We saw me sit there for about two minutes. I did not spot it. So I don't... If there were... Like, surely there was a mate, but it's not obvious. Instead, we have to play this sort of thing. Thankfully the only the opponent only has a rook and a gold. I think that's one gold. Um well hang on. That must be two golds, because the other one's not on the board. So they have a rook and two golds in hand, and however many pawns that is. Um, um Welcome. Something happened here with the chat room, and apologies for whatever technical issue that might have been. Um, I see my chat client has reconnected. Oh wait, so here my opponent lets 
Our opponent's rated 2 Don, or ranked 2 Don. Um, like, they have many, many wins. They didn't get this ranking overnight. And yet, something most bizarre is happening this game. <laughs> Alright. Oh, I can't pawn drop there. The way I wish I could. Um, hmm. What a freaking mess. Samsung. Like, taking the knight can't be best, but I'm not seeing anything better. Just disturbing. Okay. I'm about to lose this bishop. Um, but maybe it doesn't matter. Nifun. I don't like my move anymore. <laughs> oh no, what have I done? What have I done? Ippun Sanjubio. Pray for mate. Um, what the fuck? Ippun. They're actually giving this away. I don't think I had mate if they moved elsewhere. Um, but I think they're trying to do a more predictable thing and escape the king here. And I'm kind of just letting them through, because I have no idea how to deal with this. Um, I've got nothing. I've got so much less than nothing here.
20秒Good game. Well played. Yeah, I don't think... Well, okay, I don't understand what happened that game. Apparently, yeah, sure, I won the rook for a bishop. Good luck. I didn't think winning the rook for a bishop, even in that position, would constitute a big advantage. Like, a, a decisive advantage, rather. Um... So, sure, yeah, I caught the opponent in an opening trap. Um, I don't, did not think it would be decisive. Okay, so they're not going to build on Aguma. I was starting to try to build, I don't know, Tomahawk or something against it, if they were going to go that way. Which would be kind of nuts. Um, but Tomahawk's a very specific thing and I've not studied it. I know the general idea is just bear everything on this corner, but this pawn's usually here, so you could do like bishop takes. And that was not available. Um, okay. This sucks. Oh, that's fine, actually. This is not how I'd prefer to have this... It's not how I would prefer to see this played, but... I think I'm alive. Um, and we'll take that. Being alive is usually better than the opposite. But yeah, I don't think the last game I would have characterized the opponent's gesture as swindling. I just think they had many, many different ways to pursue an attack other than what they did. And yet somehow they were a bit timid, it seemed. I could be very, very mistaken in that assessment. And who am I to judge? But that was just kind of my impression about it. Um, if I bring this gold over? No. That's silly. Okay, we'll move this up. So the square is protected, even if... Hmm. Is so that so? Okay. Yeah. I guess it just shows I don't understand this game very well. Um... Ah, oh, this is adventurous. All the pawns are being pushed today. Um, Okay, I'll get a pawn in hand. Oh, 
see how much good that'll do me, but um, I think it's better to have than not to have. Oh my god. Wow. Okay. That is unexpected. Um, what's going on? The opponent has generals scattered randomly throughout their camp to protect against a bishop drop. But the bishop's right here. Um, so I just bring the rook over and mate them. And the generals just watch as I do this? Is that the narrative? Okay. So they do have an attack. This is their attack. If I push here, if they push there, if I take silver pawn... Uh, my attack's not profitable enough. Push, push, but it's still not profitable enough. Maybe I just do my attack even though it doesn't look like it works. So what else am I supposed to do here? Okay. Are we joking? Why did you take Nothing. that? What's the next move? Okay. I have to pursue what I see, because I can't pursue things I don't see. Um... So this might look a bit obvious. I've slowed their attack. So I can attack over here instead. Why would you fight on every front at the same time? All it takes is a single loss for everything to break. I don't understand this. Alright, I've got a pawn in hand again. They're just going to drop right here. So, I mean, yeah, eventually they're going to get to do this bishop drop, and it's going to get look cool when they do it. Um, hmm. I thought I had something I could do while this was all ongoing. All right, this is the idea. Bishop drop, but now it's trapped if they do that. So they have to sack the pawn in order to be able to promote their bishop. If I had two pawns in hand, we'd drop pawn one and pawn two. But I have one pawn in hand. So... This is difficult. Uh... 
I guess, arguably, I could sack to take the knight, drop the knight, and then knight takes pawn, but I don't have another general or anything to drop here. So that doesn't quite work. Um, I could push the center pawn just to get another pawn in hand. It seems extremely dicey to do so. Okay, well, I was mentioning how I have this. I didn't intend to BM that. That was just my curse or my mouse button misbehaving there. Um, yeah, it turns out my impulse of sacrifice, though, I thought was winning a piece. And I'm just blind and it doesn't win a piece. I've got a silver for a bishop. And I'm feeling pretty dumb. Um, Go home. But I guess maybe we have some emotional compensation or something for it. I don't know. The point is I should have waited one turn and led with this and not led with the sacrifice because this is just not going anywhere. Now they can drop a pawn on the knight's head. They could also try to defend this. Well, it's not easy. They could try to defend it. But, um... Okay, I'll do the obvious pawn drop. Hmm. I'm in shock. They gave a tempo. I badly needed this tempo. Um. All right, we'll take it. So, I might not be able to invade on this file, but maybe my rook switches over a file and I take things on this square. Maybe. Um, check, exchange, night drops, no good. At least that looks no good. Yeah, I'm not seeing a breakthrough here. I need more material, I think. Sampun. Well, no, hang on. This looks interesting. Apparently I just cannot count, and that might be an issue. Um, but no, my rook does promote here. It took me two minutes to see that. Um, 
but I found a good move somehow, so... Time well spent, I guess. Should not have taken two minutes to see this, but uh, it did. So... Um... Just is what it is. This is a great move. The only problem is they have a knight fork that kind of ruins it. Um, But otherwise, this shape is a good shape. Also, I do have a pawn drop that ruins it, too. But if you just ignore all the problems, it's an excellent thing. This looks ridiculous, but seems to foot the bill here. If the rook drops back, I have a knight fork here, which also looks ridiculous. Um, don't mind if I do. Nifun. Oh, this is complicated. <laughs> Why did I do that? There must have been a simpler way. Um, there must have been some simpler way about this, but I mean. The bright side is I seem to be not only surviving, but thriving here. Um, oh, time pressure must be playing a factor, not just for me. Thanks for being All right. Well, I guess since it's not the weekend, uh, we're having different results than we had over the weekend. Who would have guessed? <laughs> uh, well, as long as it was a team effort there. Anyway, I uh, hope we enjoyed these exciting games. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time.